I will spend the next 72 hours in this desert with no food, no water and no shelter. This is extremely dangerous. I can get bitten by a snake, die out of dehydration, eat something poisonous. The only materials I have is one knife, one lighter and my jacket for the night. First thing to do is to build a shelter on the mountain. Snakes, please don't come near me. I am very afraid of snakes. You might be wondering who is filming you. This is my friend Nasim, and I met him here in the United States and he helps me with the YouTube channel. And he's going to stay here with me and try to complete the same challenge, but only for 24 hours. The sun is going down. You have to build a shelter ASAP. This might be a good shelter. But the problem of oh, snakes. I found a good shelter. Come. So I found this spot here and I like it. Now we are going to build our shelter here. It's important to build a shelter to keep the animals away and to keep us warm. We are putting it on the floor of our house to not get the temperature of the floor. After hard work, we made it! This is our new shelter. And we are going to stay here for three days. The cold is going to be a nightmare tonight. It took us three hours to build the shelter. We wasted a lot of energy. First 24 hours, I think it's going to be okay. After, going to be very, 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 very difficult. I'm a bit stressed about the water because 72 hours is actually very dangerous. I might drink my pee. No. I think you're gonna be more thirsty if you drink your pee. You are going to drink your own tea? No, I'd rather just die. <laughs> we have to collect wood for the fire. There is nothing, absolutely nothing. Look at this. Only rocks, some <gasps> lizard. Thank God it's not. This is the driest desert in North America. <laughs> I have to go all the way up with this wood. Yeah, this is our wood for the night. How you feel about the day today? This is so much better right here. I came back to the car to take some empty water bottles to pee inside. This is going to be my first pee in the challenge. I know this is gross. So this is potentially my water for the next three days. The sun going down there. Everything is very dry here. We'll, we will not have proper light in our fire. Oh, it feels so good. The easiest fire I ever created. We have the perfect shelter. We have the fire here keeping us warm. The only thing is missing is water. <laughs> Tomorrow when we wake up, we are going to cut some cactuses to eat something to get water. My beautiful water. We have to take care of my pee. I love my life, but I'm thirsty. Woohoo! 3 a.m. We have the fire here. It's cold, but we got some hours of sleep. 6.41 a.m. Lydia is so asleep. So we waked up today and we came straight to find some food. Try to cut this cactus. This is the cactus from inside. I'm going to eat it. It's kind of disgusting. Right? What do you think, Nazim? You want to try? No. There is no animal life here because there is no water here. I'm dying. I found an animal inside that hole. What should I do? I thought like a dog or something like that. Coyote. I hope it's not a snake. What is that? Is that the turtle? It's a turtle. That's a turtle. What the heck? I think it's hiding. Oh, it moves. Ball. Hey, turtle. We went inside. That made my day. Bye, turtle. I don't want to stay awake anymore. I hate being awake. I want to sleep. I'm going to do something that you are going to say, Fivia, you are stupid. I will work out. I know how it will waste my energy and without water it will be extremely difficult but I didn't miss a workout day, I work out every other day for the last year and I don't want to miss today. Finished! I'm so happy that I did it. I understood that Nasim is a bit tired but it's good that his challenge is finishing in one hour. Look at my lips. I can't even smell anymore because they hurt. I never drank my pee before and I will probably never drink my pee again. 
But this time I think it's necessary to survive. Good job for making 24 hours. I drink some water for me as well. I will. Another 48 hours to go. To tell you the truth guys, I came to the United States to pursue my dream of being a YouTuber. I find a lot of problems is difficult here because I don't have a lot of money and living in LA it's very expensive for example an agreement with the owners of the place that I stay to clean the house every day for one hour and pay half of the rent but I will continue pushing forward to make it as a youtuber because it's the only thing I want now in my life there is absolutely nothing to do here and there's the car. Nasim is going to the car to drink water after a long 24 hours. It feels so good. It's time to go and find some cactuses to eat. So Nasim drank his water. We want more cactuses so I stay alive. This is a different kind of cactus. I found this cone here and I will use it to put cactuses inside and take them up the mountain. Ow. So the sun is going down again. 30 hours in the challenge now. I feel good. I feel glorious. And tonight I will be alone. I feel I'm thirsty, but I think until tomorrow I think I will be fine. I will start the fire to bake some cactus. and they have small sticks everywhere. Bye Nasim. Bye, see you. See you tomorrow. I'm not a big fan of staying alone at the night in the middle of nowhere, but I like to get over my fear. So tonight is going to be a good opportunity. I'm so thirsty. My body is telling me drink water with pain. Tomorrow I might drink my pee. We are 31 hours in the challenge is cold good morning goal of today is to save energy it felt so good sleeping in the car so i kind of feel bad for phidias he still has to be there one more day i wanted to go explore the other mountain near here but i'm very tired i feel dizzy when i walk this is more difficult than i expected i never became more thirsty in my whole life before we are going to find our turtle pet. Usually I have a lot of energy, but today that's not the case. Hey, I don't want to hurt you. Oh wow. Simba. We are going to leave you. It was great to see you again. If you find water, call me. I walk for like 10 minutes and I'm super tired. No, 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 no. is thinking about drinking his pee. I don't think that's a good idea. And it might even make him more thirsty because because of the salt in the pee. Oh. Another 26 hours left. My lips are extremely dry, but I'm very happy. I don't know if I will make it, but I will die happy. I think it's time for me to drink my pee. 48 hours in the challenge. Another 24 hours to go and I will drink my pee to prevent dehydration. This is the moment. I will smell it first. Not bad smell. That's it. I'm going to drink my own pee. Uh, Definitely doesn't taste good. Nasim is going to throw up. <laughs> you actually did it. I, I didn't think you were actually going to do it. This tastes better than the cactus. I feel a bit better actually after I drank my pee. 
but it was not good. I didn't like the taste. I will never drink pee again in my life. I have to now go and find some wood for the night. Tonight is going to be pain in the ass cold, but it's the last night. The sun went down. We stored some wood for the night. Coming to this challenge, I was afraid not going to make it, but it seems that we are doing good now. This is the last night and this is the last fire. It's 2 a.m. Another 12 hours for the challenge. Morning, Ferius. What time did you wake up? Three and a half hours to go. Never felt so dehydrated before in my life. I will sit in my shelter for another two, three hours until the challenge finishes. Two hours left, Ferius. How you feel? Horrible. This. It's a hundred percent real. I have another 30 minutes to go. You cannot imagine how excited I am for drinking water. Now only one thing left. Me to wall down this mountain alive. This is, is the second hardest video I ever did on YouTube. The first one was saying one million times Mr. Beast. We're going to start going down to the mountain. Hopefully I don't fall. Currently 2 p.m. That means I finished this challenge successfully. <laughs> I will never take water for granted anymore. <laughs> I love you, water.